my class with 15 guys, every day there's a couple less showing up. And they all had great reasons for quitting. Oh, it's too expensive. Oh, it's too far away. Oh, I miss my family. Oh, I don't like the luge. Oh, I didn't like the luge either. I was killing myself out there. First two years, I was crashing four out of five times. Four out of five. But the third year, I went from crashing four out of five to crashing one out of 100. I figured it out. See? And by then, there's nobody left. No competition. <laughs> See? Now, that guy told me nine out of 10 people quit luge. He's right. Nine out of 10 people quit luge. But he didn't tell me the whole story. Nine out of 10 people quit everything. Nine out of 10 people quit sales. Nine out of 10 people quit business. Nine out of 10 people quit medical school. Nine out of 10 people quit on their dream way too soon. Most people don't, as soon as they face a little opposition, a little challenge, they talk themselves out of it. Nine out of 10 people don't give themselves the, the, the time to learn the skills that they'll need to reach that dream. So if you, whenever you go into anything new, if you'll go in with the attitude that quitting is not an option, I'm gonna figure this puppy out and I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna win, it's a done deal. If you go in with that attitude, give it a little time, you'll learn the skills and you'll be in the top 10% because 90% of the people quit from under you. And then that's when everybody starts calling you lucky. And that works.